welcome to my channel. My name is Terranova and today I am bringing you part number nine of my Disney's Orphanage Challenge. And if you'll remember in the last part, we took a little field trip with the girls and Alice is really happy about it. She's like, look, look at the detail in her teeth. I never noticed that about the Sims before. <laughs> oh well, but anyways, um, we just brought the girls back home and we're gonna get them all ready for school because they do have school tomorrow and it's already 7.30 p.m. on a Sunday night and I'm pretty sure that everyone still has to do their homework. So that's unfortunate. But uh, let's just take a look down the line here. We have Elsa. Uh, looks like she's washing dishes. Invisible dishes. Oh, I think... Are these the ones you were trying to clean up, sweetheart? Because... Uh, there there she goes. Okay, she's, she's figuring it out. Don't worry about it, but let's check up. She is done with her uh, homework, actually, so that's really good. Um, she could invite a friend over and work on that. Oh, I did a little, I did some checking, and it looks like, um, I think it's Tiana and Elsa are actually the closest to uh, being able to age up into a teenager, so that's really cool. I'm going to have her go ahead and invite over a friend. We are going to have, should we just have Anne? Um, we're gonna have Olivia come on over. And Tiana's sleeping, but she really has to pee. So I'm gonna have her go and take care of that and then see if I can get her started on her homework. And Rapunzel's also sleeping. She's also gonna pee her pants. Alright, this... The girls are a mess. Just pointing that out. Alright, bring them over here. Um, she should probably grab some of the pancakes that we left out all day. Alright, Olivia will be right over. And then girl needs to do her homework. Um, Alice, did I? I didn't tell you to do anything yet, did I? You're in a really good mood though, so ooh, do your extra credit. Alice needs to master the mental skill anyways, so doing her extra credit will help with that. But let's check it out. Is she here? Oh, there she is. Little Olivia. Pause this. So, um, Elsa needs to become friends with this child. This little, little child. I want to know, it still says she's technically friends with one child, but I don't know who it would be. Because it's not... It's not anyone in our household. Maybe it's a teenager. Is Anne a teen? Is that... Yeah. No, I don't know. Maybe it's uni. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but I'm just gonna have her come over here and, uh, kind of, uh, just line up some social cues for her so that her and Olivia can be friends. Alright. Come on over here and talk to her. She also wants to cloud gaze with Alice still. I'm really bad about getting that done. But while she's doing that, let's go check on Rapunzel. What's wrong, sweetheart? Oh, she's so tired. She's so tired. Maybe if she gets some food in her, she'll feel a little better. How are you doing, Tinkerbell? Gonna get some of that pasta primavera? Is that what that is? Stop moving. No, don't go there. Gosh. Mac and cheese. Eat it. Just don't listen to what I'm... Don't eat it. You're not even hungry. Why don't you do... No, she's done with her homework. Awesome. So she can go and play on the violin for a few hours. Go ahead and practice. Um, She does have that Baymax toy in her inventory, though. So I'm going to put that back where everyone can play with it. And it looks like someone broke our dollhouse again. So as soon as uh, Sydney gets home, she'll have to fix that. Um, Anna, how are you doing? Did you get your homework done? No. You didn't, but you can. Kendall, why don't you help, um, help Anna. Actually, no, help Tiana. I really want her to age up, her and Elsa. I want to age up as soon as possible because they are the closest. And that's my goal for this week. I am going to be doing, this is going up on Sunday night. I'm going to have another part of this challenge up later this week. Probably Thursday. No, not Thursday. Probably Wednesday, actually. Yeah, probably Wednesday, so... That'll be fun. Maybe we can actually get them both aged up. Probably not, but I'm gonna try it. Oh, she's embarrassed. What happened, sweetie? Oh, I'm sorry. Um, why don't you discuss your interests again? Talk about school. Can we ask her how her day was? Enthuse about candy. Are we friends yet? No. Alright, what else can we do? Um... Tell her a goofy story. She might like that. Tell her this story. It was really funny about how your sister was kissed by trolls. It's it's a really good story. Share your insecurities. If we want her to be our friend, we have to trust her. 
Discuss your interests. All right, are they friends yet? No, still acquaintances. Ooh. We're getting a phone call. No. No, that's super annoying. Like, this was happening in my Animal Crossing challenge as well. Like, everyone we know just tries to call us to get us to go out with them, and we can't be bothered to do that all the time. Homework complete. Way to go, Tiana. Now, she needs to get an A in order to be able to age up. Um, and currently she has a B, so I'll have her go and eat. I'm probably not going to have her do her extra credit, but that's uh, fine. Um, I'm going to have, I'm going to have Kendall help Rapunzel next. Anna, how are you doing? Did you finish your homework? You did! Anna needs to master social and she is going to have to finish, um, her motor skill for this. So I'm going to have her go upstairs. Actually, she can go right down here. Just practice typing because she does need to do that for four total hours and that'll help, uh, that'll at least keep her productive. Research idioms? Can kids, what? Um, where do I go for this? Practice typing. There we go. All right, how are you doing? Oh, you went to pee. You need to go back downstairs and talk to Olivia wherever she went. Oh, she didn't move. Perfect. Are we, we're not friends yet. But we can tell her our favorite animal and play make-believe? No. Um, talk about our dreams again. And do another pop culture reference. And then, what's, what's something new? I want to complain about parents? No. Let's not do that. They did the best that they could. <laughs> play make-believe. Ooh, Sydney's home. Perfect. She is a little hungry and uh, a bit tired, but she needs to take care of this orphanage before uh, she can go to bed. So, it looks like everything in here is clean from what I can see. That's cool. <gasps> Reached creativity level 6, Tinkerbell! Look at her go. Tinkerbell needs to master, I think it's mental. Yeah, she needs to master mental. Um and finish creativity for this, so she's not going to age up for a little bit. But as soon as she gets that five hours, I'll send her to bed. She's going to be really tired in the morning. <laughs> um, Kendall, Sydney, you cannot go to sleep. Not Sydney, it is Kendall. Help her with her homework, please. Who just left? Tiana. Pause for a second so I can get my bearings. She's going to bed. Um, I... Guess I'm okay with that. She can do that, so then we can work on finishing her aspiration after school tomorrow. Because I want her to be in a really good mood so that she can bump it up to an A. That would be wonderful. Homework complete, Rapunzel. You can go to bed. Just go to bed. Did that work? It did. Awesome. Alice is already asleep. I'm gonna check on her homework situation. She probably left it on the table down here somewhere. This is her... I'm pretty sure that's Alice's homework. Okay, she's done. So that's cool. Tinkerbell is done with homework, so she's just working on that. Anna, how is this going? How are you doing with this? Elsa went to bed. Fine. Anna is still working on her typing, and she's almost... No, she's not even close to being done. But that's fine. I think I'm just gonna send her to bed, though, as soon as she... Can I just fast forward till she finishes that? Her and uh, Tinkerbell can stay up together. As soon as Tinkerbell is done, I will send them both to bed. But it looks like she's asleep. That's cool. Ooh, she's really not doing so good though. I'm gonna have her just kind of take care of herself a little bit and then she does have some dishes to do. No dishes to clean, don't give me that. I know there are dishes to clean. I can see them. Why don't you eat the rest of these pancakes and I'll put everything else away for you. And then she probably has to take out the trash. Oh, there is none. Okay, cool. How are you? Ooh, you're really upset. Oh, I'm going to pause this. I forgot she was still here. Um, I should really get going now. Thanks for hanging out with me. See you later. Okay. Um, it looks like Kendall finally went to bed. Um, I guess I'm okay with that. I am going to have, uh, Anna come and have a little bite to eat quick, though. Before sending her to bed, she can stop typing. Tinkerbell's in a surprisingly good mood for uh, how hungry and tired she is. She wants to play at the dollhouse. We can do that. She wants to chat with Alice. Everyone loves Alice. Tinkerbell, you're doing a really, really good job at that. 
I'm gonna have her stop though because it's really really late and I don't want to completely ruin her chances of having a decent day at school. Alright, come and have the rest of these pancakes and then you can go to bed too. There's Tinkerbell's bed right here and Anna's bed is right here. But I'm going to fast forward through this part. Ooh, Alice. Alice is awake. Oh, she really has to pee. Alright, go use the bathroom and then she's really hungry. I guess she can come down and get a bite to eat before uh, everyone else wakes up. Grab some macaroni and cheese. How are you doing, Sydney? How are you doing? She doesn't know. I think the orphanage is actually in really, really good shape today. I think Kendall did help kind of keep it clean and it, it definitely helped that they weren't there all day. So that helps. But I just want to check our dollhouse is up and uh, still standing. So that's cool. All right. Come and take a steamy shower and then you can go to sleep, my dear. My dear Sydney still has a smile on her face though. <laughs> Tinkerbell's going to bed. Anna. Alright, you're not hungry anymore. You can stop eating. And Alice. Ooh, no. Okay, well, as soon as... She'll have to come and clean it before she goes to bed. Those are the rules. I'm sorry, Sydney. I didn't mean to uh, put you through all of this. Alice is going to come downstairs. And I'm probably going to have her go back to bed, but... I kind of want to have her work on something if she can. Alice has to master the mental, so what raises the mental skill in kids? Can I have them, like, I don't even know. Uh, would, like, researching idioms help? Browse kid-friendly. I'm going to have her research idioms and see if that helps her mental skill. Um, because she's not very high. <laughs> she's, uh, only level one. And her social is almost done, so we really don't have to worry about that too much for her. Look at her just munching away on her mac and cheese on this invisible counter. <laughs> Alright. Ooh, someone is flirty. It must have been that steamy shower I had her take. Alright, now she's going to bed. Back to Alice. Does this work then? Is this helping? Oh, no, that only helps her social skill. Um, what can we do? that will help her mental skill. Can we browse kid-friendly websites? Would that help? Is this working? This does nothing. This does nothing. Does it? No, it doesn't. Okay, well, why don't we open this and read a book if we can find one. I'm pretty sure I bought books and I put them in one of these. But, to be honest, I might not have. Okay, so... Uh, I'm going to purchase books. We'll just buy a bunch of kid-friendly ones. Where, where's the smiley face? Is that? No, emotional. Children's. Alright. Ooh, we can buy homework. <gasps> I could just have her do extra homework. That would help. Um, I... Ooh. I don't think I'm going to do that. I'm just going to buy a couple books. Um, The Adventures of Pink Ruffles. We'll do that one. The First Unicorn. That's important. Um, The Lord of the Swings. Um, I think just two for now is okay. And then we'll open this. And, ooh, they're in her inventory. We'll put that one in there. And then the other one we will put in Alice's inventory. And it looks like she's going to go and empty. Oh, I forgot about that trash can. Well, way to go, Alice. Thank you for doing something productive in the household when you're bored. It is getting really, really later on in the morning now, and people are going to start waking up. But I'm going to have her start to read the first unicorn. Let me double check that. Okay, she didn't throw it away, but I can help her the rest of the way. Just hanging out over here, reading your book. She's still the only one awake, and I'm surprised by that. How is this going? Is this even helping? No. What raises their mental skill? Stop reading that. Pause this. I should have just bought more, um, what are they called? Homework things. She wanted to read something, though, so I don't know. Where'd the book go? Alice, where'd you- Oh, okay. She just left it on the ground. 
No need to panic. I'm just going to leave it right there. Right over here. So if anyone wants to read it, they can. But it looks like Elsa is awake. And she's really, 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 really hungry. I'm going to have her take a shower, though, instead of a bath. Because I feel like it's a little faster. Oh, great. That broke. Um, We can probably have her just go... Oh, it's breakfast. She can have some cereal. And then I'm pretty sure... Yeah. She'll be great. Alright, everyone has to go to school in an hour. Let me pause this and make sure everyone is queued up to uh, get their needs taken care of for the morning. Tiana can go. Actually, that's like her only need. So she can take a bath and then go use the bathroom. And Rapunzel is going to need a little bite to eat. So you can have some yogurt. Alice. Oh, I guess I should double check that all of their homework is done. I'm pretty sure it is. Alright, Tiana's done, Rapunzel's done, Alice is done, Tinkerbell is done, Anna, and Elsa. Okay, so everyone did finish their homework. Way to go, girls. So proud of you. She's gonna go chat in the kids' chat room. Um, yeah, whatever, that's fine. That'll help her social. She needs that anyways. Tinkerbell, girl, you gotta get up. You're gonna be late for school. Go use the toilet. And then you can go and get yourself a bowl of cereal. Anna needs to get up too. She just she's sleeping the day away. <laughs> Alright, use that toilet. Um, and then Elsa. You're gonna go get some food. I think that's a great idea. Alright, Sydney, what are you doing? Because we've got like a mess going on in our kitchen down here. <laughs> we have a puddle, a broken dishwasher. It's just not looking good. I want you to come and repair that, please. And then you can mop that up. And then you can actually get yourself some cereal. Tinkerbell, is everything going okay in there? Do you need any help? Probably not. Alright, I'm gonna speed through this a little faster. Kendall should actually be awake. She's supposed to be awake in the morning when the girls are getting ready. But she can come and get some yogurt, too. Who's calling someone? Someone's phone is ringing. I heard it. Oh, Elsa, who's calling you? Hey, I heard you became friends with Rapunzel Lost Princess. She's pretty cool. Who are you? Are you our lost sister? <laughs> they, they could be. I don't know. Maybe. No? Okay. Um, ooh. Anna wanted to finish her extra credit. Maybe we can do that after school this time. Today. Oh, everyone's late for school. Okay. Um, you're going to school. Stop eating. Stop eating. Stop eating. I'm really sad that I have to make everyone stop eating just to go to school. Alright. They are going. What can we do for you two? Because you seem a little upset. Is it just the surroundings? Alright. Why don't you load the dishwasher for your sister? And I'm just going to take care of some of these plates for them. Uh, I'll just put that over there. Tinkerbell is off to school. Yay! Everyone's gone and off to school so what what can we do to help you here you need to raise your fun and your sister is being nice enough to help kind of take care of um the messy kitchen oh now who's calling you anna uh would we'd love to have you join the renegades no she can't join a club she is busy being an orphan and working to age up Alright, so you're mopping the puddle. What are you doing? I keep getting them confused because they're wearing the same color right now. Alright, so Kendall needs to go use the toilet. Go do that. Oh no! This sink is broken too. Come and repair that. <laughs> Throw away. Oh, that's the garbage thing. And then do this first and then come and mop the puddle, please. And Kendall, we can work on you for a little bit right now. Um, you, she's really not got much to do right now, but we could- Ooh, spelling bee aid. It's the school spelling bee and Tinkerbell has made it to the final round, but this time she's never even heard of the word she's supposed to spell. Glancing around the room, Tinkerbell sees the class Brainiac flash her, her notebook with a word written neatly on it. Should she accept the help or give it her best guess? Um, I'm gonna say, who is this? Tinkerbell. Tinkerbell, I feel like, would want to prove that she can figure it out herself, so she's going to give it her best shot. Tinkerbell knows she can do this on her own. She closes her eyes, blocks out the notebook, and guesses each letter slowly. Incorrect! The Brainiac falls off her chair, laughing. Still better to lose honestly, right? Yes, I 
completely agree. I, com I, I agree with what happened with Tinkerbell. Where are you, are you gonna go repair it? You had to leave the room to go to repair it. Oh no, she's sad. It's gonna be really hard. Oh, she can use this to uh, fuel her creativity though. That'll be fine. Not happy about it, but it, it'll be fine. Now what are you doing? Taking out the trash? Look at these two working together to take care of this orphanage. While the girls are all at school, I'm gonna click on her butt just so I can get her to put her everyday clothes on because she, seriously, she's just walking around in her pajamas all day long. Now who's calling you? Uh, Johnny Zest would like to come over. This is okay, so if he's still over when the girls get home from school, they can befriend him. And that will be really good for the social girls. Can I get this to throw away? Why can't I get this to throw away? Well, maybe she'll have to throw it away herself, but she's got... Ooh, she's got some needs. Does she work today? Yes, at 5 p.m. Okay. Well, I am just going to have her... She's going to go and play her instrument. She has to play for a couple hours anyways. So why don't you go ahead and practice? She needs to get to level 2 in order to get a promotion anyways. And she needs to practice for her daily task. So that'll be fine. What are you up to? Another phone call? Are you serious? I don't see anyone's phone ringing. Alright, I guess not. What are you up to? Why don't you go downstairs and prepare a nice, big, hearty meal for all of our girls for when they get home. Let's, can we just cook? What do we have to choose from? Let's go to the high end. We could do spaghetti. I don't think we've had that yet. We're going to go for the party size. Alright, oh, I should probably have these girls... Actually, I'm going to have Elsa study hard, and I'm going to have Tiana study hard. The rest I'm not too worried about, because those two are the closest to aging up anyway, so they definitely need to get A's. Oh, look, Johnny Zest is here. I suppose we should probably, like, talk to him, or he'll leave. Can we... Oh, are you sad, Johnny? What's wrong? Can we try to cheer him up? Can we do that? Just try to cheer him up. While we're trying to cook. He can talk to us while we're in the kitchen, right? Um, tell him... Give him a compliment. Ooh, we acquired the violin skill. Good, we need that. Brighten his day. Also, I'm sorry if you can hear that. My cat is laying on my printer and she pushed a button. And it just made some very strange noises. Um, why don't you get to know him? I really don't care if you guys are friends, though, so resume the spaghetti. Ooh, we got mail. Oh my gosh. <gasps> this is awful. Oh, we just got our bills, and they're over 10 grand, and we have two days to pay them. Okay. All right. We gotta start selling stuff to pay for our bills. And that's really unfortunate, because we have to start selling things that uh, we need for the challenge, like our our skill items and our allotted fun items. That's really gonna suck. Okay. Um. Well. <sighs> reached cooking level 5. Way to go. Way to bring some happiness into this. This is gonna be awful. We won't have any money left. Literally none. Um. Sydney. When's your. <sighs> She's only level 2. But she makes really, really crappy money. I should have got her a better paying job. If I'm being honest. <laughs> but at least this way. Like. She's. Like, she's got the whole morning to take care of herself. I don't know. This is... I don't know what to do. Alright. I think, uh, Kendall's gonna have to start writing books during the day. To, uh, help. Should Alice invite over Samuel? Yes! Should Tinkerbell invite over Alexander? Sure. Sure. Everyone can invite over whoever they want. Grades are up! Look at all those A's! Alright, I'm gonna pause this. Um, the girls are home now. And it looks like Anna's gonna go take a nap, which is fine, and Alice is also gonna go take a nap, which is also fine. But let me look at Tiana, because she is, she does have an A now. And uh, we just need to finish this, get her to draw five more pictures and gain three more levels. So I'm gonna have her start to do that right away. I'm not gonna worry about the bills until they are like absolutely due. We have two days, so I'm gonna have her come over here. I'm not going to have her do her homework just yet in case we can actually age her up tonight. So that's my plan. So I'm going to have her draw... I don't know what she's drawn so far. I'll have her draw people. 
And Elsa, where are you? Reached violin level two. Perfect. Pause. How are our... Oh, oh goodness. Oh, gracious. Oh, there's my timer too. Um, well, that was my timer, so I'm going to end it here. I'm just going to queue up some things for our Sydney to do to kind of take care of herself. She can probably have some cereal too. But I... I'm going to end it here. In the next part, we will finish out this day and hopefully, hopefully we can get Tiana to age up and Elsa a little closer to aging up. So, oh, don't leave. Pause. Don't let him leave. Don't let him leave. But, oh, I already got that. But anyways, sorry, I'm getting a little distracted. Um, I'm going to end this part here. This was part number nine of my Sims 4 Disney's Orphanage Challenge. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Also, leave a comment. Uh, let me know what you thought about this part, what you think about this series so far. Just anything I'd love to hear from you. But anyways, my name is Terranova, and I hope you all have an absolutely fantastic day. Bye, guys.